So, we are in Lanzarote. If you don't know what Lanzarote is, I'm gonna tell you right now. It is an island. So Lanzarote is here. We're very close to Africa. Yeah, we're very close to like Western Sahara. Actually, yeah, closer to like Morocco and stuff, like Northern Africa. You see, this is where we are. This is the Western Sahara. This is like Morocco and stuff. And then Spain, where we live, it's right here. Madrid, you see? So we came all the way from here to here. So, now we're here and we got this Airbnb in the middle of the islands, like in the middle of the wild nature of, I don't even know how to describe this nature, it's so cool. It's giving like a mix of Western Sahara with like Arizona and the United States and like, I don't even know how to describe. Anyways, we got some stuff for the house to have food for the next days a bit not much just something chill and if you want to see i can show you so i got this salgadinho here this little they snack know what is, this little snack oh we got <laughs> this That's onion boring. this onion it's really bothering me because we had red onions at lunch and yeah the bread there's, there's some we try these no Ah, Lotus, but you told me about uh, these a lot of times, no? I never tried. I never tried. That was all. Oh. Uh, so tasty. Bro, if the one films this. Welcome to Central Pain. Well, I... Well, I was expecting the weather to be a bit sunnier today, but it's not, really. No, well, it's, when we arrived, it was... It's windy. It's windy, but maybe it's getting better still. Well, I... didn't sleep very well, did I? I heard you, I heard you wake up in the middle of the night. I had some weird ass dreams. You have no, no, no I went to pee once. Yeah, that was it, no? Which I usually don't do, but I drank a lot of water before, so I had to pee that night. That was it, no? That was it, yeah. But I didn't sleep well. Mm -hmm. At all. Mm -hmm. I took a long time to fall deep asleep. I was not deep asleep I, for I a did. long I time. It was very hot, so I sweat.
Literally, bro. Get your shit together. <laughs> It's me. I just want to let it pull to me. Do it, do it. What? I just want to taste it. I just want to taste it. So, the weather is not giving. We would like to tan, for example, but. This is not giving tan. But you never know. You have to trust St. Peter. Maybe it gets better. Like, look at these windows. Half of those windows at the top there are hidden away by the bloody trims. I have no idea what they were thinking of there. Why did they go with hexagonal um, columns on each end there? The weird choices of well, windows that they skip inside. Chan, I literally can't. I literally can't. I literally can't. Do you think this is normal? Gothic chandeliers hanging from them. I can't bear them. You look down into a piano room down there. Bro, this house is so ugly, I can't. Point. It's a man, it's just 26 it's years old. We go so 25, like this. But how much counter space do you need with no cupboards? Do you know what I mean? Like, I just can't. What is the pleasure really, of watching people it build the houses in the there. It really does. <laughs> We forgot our fucking towels. Bro, that was the whole point. We arrived, we drove one hour to the beach now, and we forgot our towels. The Airbnb gives you towels to bring to the beach. And then I mean, maybe they have like a like a shop, like... <sighs> well, I don't know, bro. At this point, I'm gonna put on my flip -flops. I mean, probably we weren't gonna get into the water anyways. Because it's... No, cold. but to, for us to lay down, we need something. Would be good to have our Well, towels. let's not judge before we have. Let's go check yeah, it out. Yeah, maybe there's something the there is. to save us. Whatever. But that was so dumb. That was very stupid. So dumb. This hypochondriac not only brought a whole bag of medicine to the trip, <laughs> but he has to bring it in the fucking car as we go to the beach in case he gets sick on the way to the beach. Bro, if you imagine, bro, so many things can happen. So I'm burning. I'm cooking inside this car. I need to leave. What do you want? We're gonna get so bored. We're not, bro. Why'd you come to the beach okay, for? Okay, fine, fine. I'm gonna bring my What'd book. What'd you do at the beach? I'm gonna bring my book. Yeah, whatever. Bring that book. I'm the sunscreen. You bring that shit. How? Bro, nothing fits inside this Meaning, thing. I can bring the book for you. Yeah, bring the book then. <laughs> fine. Okay. Then you guys come also. Let's go. Do you, do you want the shirt? No? No picture, no picture, please. Oh, okay, okay, sorry. That was so unnecessary. That was a very unnecessary. Now, we go to our house. Okay, well. So, we're deciding what to do tonight. Because there was a party. Apparently it started at 3 p.m. And now it's 8 p.m. or something, 9 p.m. So we're not gonna be able to make it to the party. Hola. Hola. So we went to the fucking supermarket to get ourselves dinner and 
I don't know what happened there. Um, but Francisco decided it was necessary to take a picture. So because of that picture, he decided to drift on to the sand and we got stuck in the sand with the car. So we're in the middle of the desert right now with this car stuck in the sand, which I have sand in my mouth, in my hair. I have sand everywhere because we've tried to get this car out. And no, we pushed the car. We did everything. We had to remove sand like this. With our hands, we With were like, hands, nobody, to to nobody's take helping sand. us. We called the 911 of the, the island. The of the island. And they basically told us, that's not our fucking problem. You need to call the car service. They don't respond, obviously. And then we found one of the car services, places that's open now. And we just called them and they're about to come save us. Um, and we bought stuff to do hot dogs and because we were gonna do a chill night with hot dogs and I decided to stop to take a cute picture for one second it was 8 p.m. now it's 10 p.m. we've been stuck here for two hours no dinner no nothing I was fresh clean out of the shower we just had to do a small quick stop at the supermarket now I'm full of arena with no food in my stomach it's fine let's see the response So, here goes a little story for you guys. We made it back. They know because we, we vlogged before, no? Yeah, we vlogged with our phone. Now we're back at the house with our camera. We Did made you, it out. Would you like, would we, you like to give your deployment first? We, 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 it took us three hours, we made it out. It was a very stressful situation. I've what time is it now? In 11, yeah, it was like three hours. The sweet Paul, sweet guy So, there's this Paul. very sweet guy called Paul. The sweetest, kindest soul. He's so sweet. He came, he's a British guy that lives here in Lanzarote, came to help. He had to leave his house and help us. So if he did it, he did it, everything with a smile on his face. He was so sweet with us, he's so helpful. Honestly, I think that Paul deserves all the love in the world. He I send him so, so many good vibes. So many I good hope energy. he has the best day tomorrow and the best day every single day. Every single day. Because Paul, like... It's very like, sweet He's not like, gonna wow. see this. Yeah, this no, because like, we were like, bro, listen, like this car stuck here, like we really need help. The guy was like, bro, it's not that deep. <laughs> like, the guy was like, we're yes. Like, we're like, mom, like this car. Mom, like this car's a little stuck, here, like, bro. Right now, bro, like. Like, bro, come then, save us, man. And then the and guy then was, was like, like, listen, I can't help with that. He's like, that's kind of like you issue. Yeah. <laughs> like, he's like, call, issue. leave the car there. Tomorrow, call the company and chill. He was like. Leave the car, go fuck yourself. Yeah. And then it's somebody else's problem. Pendejos, he said. Yeah. He said pendejos. He never said that. Well. What's your favorite color?
like full on run over this Mino. pigeon. It's Mino. 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 Go. Bro, you have to go save him. No, Tell him, go. That was a whole fake thing. What? He flew out in the pass. Oh, he was pretending? He pretended to be a homeless, hurt guy that needed help. Where's the camera? Think to wear as a necktie, Tom. Why aren't you laughing? 